Good evening and welcome back to Odd Sparks. I've had a slight change of clothing, as you can see. We are now hmm, we have a brown brown robe on. Bit of hair, shorts. Yeah, I went through. There's a, a character editor here, so you can change character. There you go. That is what we look like now. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. And I've got an emerald. Because that makes sense. Yeah. Um, uh, yes. uh, so, where were we and what were we doing? Uh, we need to get some things for our missions. Okay. So, we need to get wooden logs and sawn timber. We need to get wooden logs for that one. We need to uh, deliver a stumpy spark, a shard, and 100 wooden logs to the divine researcher. And uh, we also need to um, build a logger, connect the logger to the shrine, and so on and so forth. Okay. Okay. So. So, let's zoom around here. So, if I turn the camera around, we can see behind there is an automated thing here. Uh, so, we want to get um, logs going into here. Now, this is a tree that allows us to build a logger. If you remember, in the town, there's a place where you can generate infinite trees. I think out here, we can get uh, infinite wood using sparks. So, let's come here. Let's ask... Um, and we've got two sparks on us as well. So, let's see. What do we need to build... Wait, let's press B to bring the building up. Uh, refineries. Edit tool. Uh, I think oh, I can't build a logger yet because we actually need to complete this one. We need to bring 10 logs. Okay. Okay. I don't know if I can tell my guy to harvest the big tree. Some don't require special sparks to harvest them. Callback sparks and aim mode to cancel the order. Ah, okay, so you can't you can't do it. Okay. Come back. So I need to send you over to the little one instead. Okay. <laughs> I can't unfortunately help with the little one. Um and we're only down one tree. One uh thing at a time, so I'm just gonna kind of we could go back into the town. And get infinite wood that way. I think that's going to be our best bet for the moment. Let's let's go in here. Uh, sparks, not smarts. Sparks are not smart. They will walk in on the right side of the path and try to interrupt. With okay. Ah, yeah. So they always walk on the right hand side of the path. So see, so he's always walking on the inside. You're walking around the outside, and you're walking there. Okay, but uh, that's not what we want to come over here. Click on this guy here, and if I click and hold, we can generate some wood here. So let's generate some wood and get ourselves some wood, and then we can give that to the blokey so that we can get the lumber mill done, and then we can automate getting wood. It's not bad, it gives us 30 minutes, but you have to be here and hold the uh, the button down to make it work, so. There we go. Okay. Let's drop 10 wood in there. Drop's mm -hmm. good. In. Get ready. Get the quest log. Uh, I did. Yes. Yep. Boom. Okay. So we've got the logger and a B a B elephant carapace. Mm -hmm. Since they're so small, they need a load table, and it's done. More very important things. You need a B elephant carapace to build the logger. The carapace stabilizes the aether in the giant trees. Mm -hmm. You don't really know what that means? But well, let me tell you, I personally tried harvesting these giant trees without uh, etheric stabilizers. It took two whole months to regrow my mustache. Oh. Mm -hmm. You can find the beef and carapace on beef and corpses that are around the woodlands. I'll give you what I have spare. Awesome. Yay. You've unlocked your first building. Enter build mode and select something to build. Build mode remembers the last five constructed buildings and opens the last selected building. Press B. Okay. Remembers the last five constructed buildings. All right, so we need to build one of these here. Uh, and I can rotate it. Aha, so that's what we'll do. We want to rotate it. We can't put it there because um, it's, it's red. So we'll have to put it like this way. Uh, I need to get more stone and wood. Okay. Let's go and get more stone and wood. I know where stone and wood is, so... Um, I don't know if you can get a stone. Can you get a stone? 
Yes, you can. Awesome. I'll give this some wood. You get some stone. Actually, I need to get some stone as well. Uh, need some more wood. Ha. She wanted to gather the wood, but that's okay. Uh, would you? Do, 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 do. Right, there we go. That should be enough. Yeah. I can actually help the, uh, the spark grab the wood there, so. Okay, let's go. Okay, build me a look. Ah, so if you press B, it quickly brings up the last building you have selected. That's okay. I like that. Like that. Boom. There you go. Okay. Nice. Uh, oh, we can put sparks in here to uh, to to mine stuff. There. Okay. So let's get a path going, then, shall we? Uh, B. Logistics pathing. So if I do that, Just throw sparks onto paths. Okay, so my friend, you're going to go onto this path. Okay, and then we are going to throw you and you in there. You slow right down when you're carrying stuff. That's okay. That's okay. You're gonna try that. So let's let's um take that out of there and only have one in there. And then you will just start putting wood into here. Look, we have our first piece of automation. That was easy. That was very very easy. Um, yeah. I'm also confused as to why some of these have got green things and some have got brown they should all have brown because it should all be my i uh, know the brown one is what I've, is following the green one is the default one so okay so this can only have hmm? no hang on this should be able to have five in it it's only got four in there why is it not putting any more in there That's very confusing. Hmm. Okay. Well, we need to go and find some more. Um, uh, is that so? I'm going to have a quick wander around. So, this is the edge of the map over here. What's over here? We've got more ruins of a small ancient workshop. I don't know what you do with that. so we can make some more uh, guys cool okay <clears throat> there's another big tree there cool oh there's our big tree Okay, so if I drop the ether in there, you'll get to work making me some more stumpy sparks. Cool, cool, cool. Right. So now you hopefully will drop the uh, wood off in there. No, you won't. Why not? Or 
ดซักเป็นเทศว่าจะอยู่ drop off point how how where's where your input point yeah that's an output point ah uh, the input point from the front go So right click to remove the path, left click to install the path. So there, boom, you'll come down and you'll drop there. I'm sure he dropped wood in there first time around. I'm, I'm sure that happened. Maybe, maybe I completely missed it, but I'm, I'm sure he dropped wood in there first time around. So there we go. Awesome. And I assume I can throw multiple ones onto the path. Yep. as well It looks like we might be able to get one in time. Oh yeah, we get loads in there. Awesome, right? So I can take one off of it. So can I come to me? There you go. You have to right click to just just right click tap to grab one of it. So I think three will be enough to deliver enough to get to this. To make all the things i don't know how far you got to you stop but that's cool okay let's go back into town uh, actually hold on hold on let's change the plan let's change the plan Ooh. uh let's grab all the wood Here we go. go back in town because we also need to deliver wood to somebody don't we Wrote it down your quest log. Wrote what down? Craft 10 stuff. Oh, sorry. Yeah, okay. While well, they're doing that. Right, so I was thinking, maybe we can get these sparks not just to harvest wood, but to actually craft with. Need quite a lot of materials to try out some different ideas, but you and your sparks can do it. Was a hundred wood. Okay, I accept. And we can get a sawned one. Awesome. We need that. Let's make something new together. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I need to basically um, <clears throat> gather uh, 80, 100. That is going up still, so that is actually working off camera. Nice. So that, so our carry our production still continues on until it's there. So nice, awesome, uh, cool. And a hundred logs there. So I need to capture. I need to get loads of logs and loads of ether. So um, let's go and do that. It's gonna take a little while to do, but that'll be okay. I should be able to throw my sparks out and get things done and explore and find some corpses and stuff and pick up the uh, the things we need. You're, you're going to make two more, which is nice. Awesome. Uh, we can obviously grab 20 from this every time, so that's cool. But I need to get the corpses and things. So I will go on a little bit of a searching spree to find more aether shards and more everything. And we shall be right back. So we have enough wood to do the things. We have also completed making 10 sparks, which is awesome. We've now unlocked a barrel and a shed. 
Entry nods as you explain what happened when you created the production line. The lips relax into a soft, satisfying smile. <laughs> nice. Hey, I made some storage buildings for you and the Sparks. Awesome. Storage buildings are always good. Cool. cool. My first production line complete. Yay. My first production line. Uh, right, what did you want? You wanted 100 locks. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Perfect timing. Let me show you my final design. So, much of the machinery is inside the building. It simplifies the work so those sparks of yours don't have to do anything complex. Uh, no offence, but they're not very smart. When I try to give a complex order to one, they just get very confused. Of course, there's always more room for improvement, but try it out. Also, we have unlocked the saw bench. Nice. And we can come down here. Uh, I went out hunting for uh, Aether Shards, and um, I found a stash which had... Um, uh, 24 in, I think it was, so, um, yeah. Oh, cool. there you go, and we'll give you our spot. There you go. Uh -huh. I'm sure you'll be able to do it very quickly. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm done! So there's no way of building this without an ancient, without ancient bases. The piping is vital. I can't quite replicate it, but I've also made the process, I made it process ag agnostic. Process agnostic. Uh -huh. It means you can use it to make other types of sparks. Yeah. I know there are more shrines out there, but... <laughs> I bet you're a warm dinner that there's more sparks too. Oh, there's always those... I always thought they were statues with minor deities, but... I always thought these, that these statues, wow, were minor deities, but to think they were creatures. <laughs> okay, so, uh, cool, we've received 10 stubby sparks, do we? Nice, nice, awesome. Okay, let's put one down here. Uh, well, okay, so. <gasps> Wait, what? Minions, assemble! Yes. All the sparks are mine. Look at them all go, line up in a row. <laughs> it's my army. It's my army. Awesome. Okay, I didn't know you could put multiple ones down there. Ah, oh, I could have been gathering stuff so much quicker. Oh. Oh well. Okay, so do, 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 do. we have a new building. We have a um, and we have uh, a saw bench and a spark workshop. So we can produce sparks. Faster? More, more? So this has come to an end because it's got a kind of store 10. So got loads of eight shards. I found, I found things. Also got another uh, carapace. I found a dead, a dead uh, beef um, which uh, they're big. They are, they are big. Right, so 10 is the maximum I can have. Oh, it's still beautiful. Still beautiful. Um, and also, let's come up here. Do, 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 do. Because there's loads of trees around, which is nice. Well, looky, looky, we found another shrine up here. Look. Glows lightly under your touch, and the carvings on the stone begin to shift. Test start. Attempt to create one atheist shard. Connection not found. Test failed. Reconnect to function. Machine range one. Okay, so we'd have to upgrade the town hall one to un update that, and then we can automate making sparks completely. Animating force of the sparks, the etheric distillation process. So, yeah, so these are the ancient workshops. So um, that means our uh, this one can only be placed on top of these guys. So we could have loads of sparks being made all at once. So that's cool. We don't want to do that yet, I don't think. Uh, what I need to do is make a saw mill. Which is this guy. I need to put this down where our wood is. 
do 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 save. Somewhere because we want to obviously uh, automate um, this. So I'm going to put it here. Oh, uh, no, I'm not. I need 20 wood. Well, that's okay because. Uh, and then we're going to try again. 20 wood there. And I'll put it there because it means I should be able to build a path to there. And they'll come along. And they won't dump in that one because um, they only walk on the right side of the road. Okay. Okay, so I'd, I'd like them to actually put into this one first. What if we was to remove this road? Oh, no, not the buildings. Don't the buildings. Oh, they drop. Oh, no. They drop on the floor. Ah! No, it's my Okay, this is a teleporter, I guess. Uh, and what we'll do is we will run a... Like that. So they'll walk up the right hand side here, they'll turn this way, dump in here, walk along, and then dump in there. So if this one's full, they'll dump in in this one instead. Okay, and then what I'm gonna do is I think I want to have a storage. I want to put it like here. Oh, I need five wood. There. Okay. I can throw all ten on there at once. <laughs> Away they go. <laughs> oh, ah, no, that's not what I Um. A mistake. That's okay. They put the bad storage there, but okay. So there goes. They're dumping the storage here. Cool. Now they come running back down the path. I have no idea how many I have on that thing there, but yeah, they come down. They put all in here. Once this is full, they then start putting the sawmill, and the sawmill needs um, two guys working in it, I suppose. Let's throw some wood in there just to get it running. 7.5 a minute. Cool. And you're going to make the sawn timber. Awesome. And then all the wood that we don't use, we end up in this storage here. Because it's the end of the line. So if I was to dump the rest of my sparks on there. Go. Go, minions. Go. Look at them go. Do, 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 do. Few of them seem to be now be walking past with the logs. There we go, and we dump the logs in there, and then we can collect more because this will fill up with logs completely. So yeah, there we go. So we are filling up our our stumpy spot, trying making stumpy spots first. 
uh, with any ace that we have or ether uh, and then uh, we're getting storm timber because this going in and you get and then it goes in there and awesome really operational battle sparks nice got right here sword number e cool 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 Ah, and the sparks just walk by if there's no logs for them to pick up. I might want to take a couple off that by the looks of it. So, let's um, grab all of them. I think a lot of them end up in my inventory, don't they? Yeah. Okay, let's just dump ten on here, shall we? we need to do uh, this one don't we yeah can I pin this pin there you go Boom. 80 dogs 40 lumber intend to be fine for this production chain here not the most optimal by the looks of it, um, so we could definitely do better, but that's okay. You're gonna, well, so you've run out now, so we can't actually do anything more with that. So I'm gonna take you and you away. They're still gonna fill this up with 10, 20 dogs, but now they just will be going into the lumber, the uh, sawmill. Yeah. Got these uh, pellets as well, I don't know quite what to do with those. I guess they are for making the eighth shards or something. I'm not, just not sure. Uh, but yeah, cool, cool, cool. Okay, so uh, 80 wood and 40 timber. So we need this to go through once more, and then we just need this to uh, do its thing. And we'll be good to go. Okay. 80 wood, 40 timber. And we go and hand in this to the mayor. Two, 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 two. two four, six, eight, two, four. There we go. It's so much quicker mining with ten stumps. It's, it's amazing. So, do do, yay! The mayor takes in the three items she asked for with disbelief. Amazing! I never imagined you get so much so quickly. Thank you so much, my dear. We'll make sure to put this to all to good use. Everything is set up, but we need just that last bit of elbow grease to finish the project. Do you think your sparks can help us out there too? Finish the construction site at the marketplace. Oh yeah, here we go. Bump. Ready? Go, minions, go! I have a question. Are those sparks of yours good at defending themselves? Or say, a trade caravan? We avoid disturbing wild animals, but sometimes they attack. And of course, there are also bandits. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can help, but I uh, that was something weak. Plant some field bunnies for me. You'll find a lot of them in the woodlands. Oh, awesome. We have to kill five field bunnies. And we shall do that mm. in the next episode. That could be with the forest bunnies, all right? If you attack one of those, the whole nest will come after you. Ah. Okie dokie. Spark combat 101. But one. Yeah. Okay. So we shall do this one here. We shall come back next time. We shall carry on from there. We shall go into combat. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed this one. And I hope to see you again in the next one. And until then, as always, have fun.